26 tonight, tougher OWI laws could be coming to Wisconsin, the number one state for drinking and driving offenses. Local legislators say right now the laws just aren't working, so they're introducing several bills in Madison. NBC 26's Raquel Lamel spoke with the lawmaker and tailgaters today about this proposal. She's live at Lambeau with their thoughts. Raquel? Well, Stacy, just take a look around me here. There's literally tailgates everywhere up and down the parking lot. Most of them include alcohol, but some lawmakers tell me the rules in the state need to be stiffer in order to keep people from driving and getting behind the wheel. Game day and alcohol seem to go hand in hand in Titletown. Hey, you want to have me a beer, actually? But several lawmakers in Northeast Wisconsin are co sponsoring bills that would tighten the laws on drinking and driving. It's a serious problem in Wisconsin. People have too much to drink and they get behind the wheel and it has fatal and very tragic consequences many times. The new bills include jail time if you injure someone while drinking and driving and a first OWI offense could mean $500 fine, 30 days in jail and a misdemeanor charge. I do feel we're getting a little overboard with our punishments. Ted Withy from La Crosse worried tightening the laws too much could have potentially bad consequences. Let's not make them so harsh that we're filling up our jails with people that don't mean to do mean bad things. But if you ask Green and Gold fans from other states with stricter OWI laws, they have a different view. I, I think, personally, I think that's a good thing. Uh, I don't think people should be drinking and driving. Two sides to an issue that'll be getting a lot of attention at the state capitol in the coming weeks. Now, Representative Andre Jacques says some of these laws have been brought up in the past before. And he's hopeful several of them will be voted through in the future. Live in Green Bay at Lambeau Field, Raquel Lamel, NBC 26.